later tonight. We got the Rowdy Rough Boys, right? Let's hit it. Yeah, and then uh, so we're gonna start you off right now with a little improv. Anybody seeing improv for the first time? Okay, then forget it. Okay, how about a suggestion of uh, like a, a, a something for the '80s, like a, a, a song? For Cocaine. Cocaine. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Okay, you two. Get in here. <laughs> I found this in your bedroom. <laughs> you like to explain yourselves? It's cocaine. Uh, I know what it is, Travis. I know what it is. Okay. I want to know where you got this from. Oh. Cynthia, you have something to say for yourself? <laughs> no, we're told not to tell we were told we we have discussed this before. There are gonna be no drugs in this house. Now the two of you get in the closet. You're gonna do all these drugs. <laughs> That's our punishment? Your punishment is do, you're gonna do them all in record time. And you're gonna oh, see no. how painful it is to do that much drugs in a short sitting. Get in the closet. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Where have you? Where'd you get so much cocaine? We can't tell you. It's secret. We're not supposed to say. Okay, look. Look. <laughs> you two selling the coke? <laughs> <laughs> nope. <laughs> Something tells me you're lying. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I saw that. <laughs> Maybe you need to do a little coke. Oh, someone's at the door. <laughs> I embarrassed this family. I hear to see Travis. We got something that I want to buy. Sure, mechanic. <laughs> Jacko? Do you got this stuff? Uh, uh, you mean the mechanic stuff? Sure, the mechanic stuff, Jack. <laughs> no, we don't have the mechanic stuff. <laughs> Tony said you got the mechanic stuff. He sent me over here to get the stuff. Jack, I'm in the middle of something here. I'm trying to raise a couple of kids. Dwayne, <laughs> <Sure. laughs> I appreciate your dilemma. But I got business with Travis. I have business with Travis. <laughs> Dwayne, I appreciate your dilemma, but I have business with Travis. Jocko, look, I understand that you need the mechanic stuff, okay? And I'm sure that Travis can give you the mechanic stuff. I need I... several kilos of mechanic, mechanic stuff. stuff. <laughs> Jess. All right, well, Travis, why don't you step outside and get him the several kilos of mechanic stuff while I deal with your sister? <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's a yes. She's not into it. It's not her fault. She's just not a spirited. Equine being. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I thought I could do it today, but I'm just not ready to nay my powerful nay. <coughs> Looks like Calyx cowardling out. Look, I'm just not over my breakup with Jimmy, okay? <laughs> We heard, we heard. <laughs> Do you know who he's with now? Oh, don't tell her, don't tell her, don't tell her. No, I need to know, I need to know. It'll help me move on, it'll help me move on. <laughs> you tell him. A nag, her back is all swayed, her, her hoes are gnarly. You're telling me Jimmy's with Phil. <laughs> he said, he said she makes him feel special. 
He said that to me once. He says that to all the man. <laughs> what? Have you me too? Now they know he said it to you. Unbridled passion. I thought I was a special host. He said I was his first. He's a breeding stud cow. What are you thinking? I looked into those big eyes, those teeth that could chew a carrot in five seconds, <laughs> those thighs and that the go off, the wind when it pisses Ooh. like a river. <laughs> So, Phyllis, would you like some champagne? <laughs> Presentation? No. 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 Just say no. no. Just say no. Okay. <laughs> okay. Definitely not. Yo, what about if you're super, super sleepy and you get Sudafed? Yeah. Wait, you don't do that. No, so it's not even kind. Did no. they make uh uh uh? You only other drugs out take of. things when they're necessary. What if you okay. take the Sudafed and you're super sleepy? Did you take cocaine after that? No. That would be <laughs> necessary, though. Wouldn't My mom it? says Xanax is necessary. <laughs> uh, well. I, your mom might, might have her reasons. Uh, but my mom says Valium is necessary. <laughs> well, my mom tried Valium, but she finds that Xanax takes the edge off better. My mom takes the edge off better. Well, that's your mother, that's not you. Uh, I saw my mom buy rolling papers. What? <laughs> like, you can roll your own cigarettes, that is legal. Maybe. <laughs> that one is cash with the marijuana when she rolls her own. I'm hoping you're talking about the kind that you have for breakfast. No, he's been kind of rolling a record. <laughs> what? 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 My, my mother is cocaine. That's still cocaine, right? It's still the same thing. Oh my god. You she puts I, it on the Almond Brothers record. Is it yeah. <laughs> yeah. Or, 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 or the White Album. Or the White Album. <laughs> uh, I'd like to call you to my office. We've been having some complaints from the parents. Um, it seems as though all their kids are high. <laughs> I, I'm, doing, I'm doing my best, Superintendent. You're doing your just, best to teach them to no, get high? No, 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 no. I mean, they're just, they're so informed. They know things I don't know, Superintendent. <laughs> I don't know about doing things on records. They didn't teach me that in school. They just said, tell them to say no, and that some drugs have their place that are prescribed by a doctor, and... That all seems very reasonable. I think so. Do you know where they're getting their drugs? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it seems like a lot of them, uh, uh, their parents... You know, sometimes you get to an age where you're no longer in the loop. 
Right. You know, and, and I want to go to a party, listen to some records on the old friends' table. Super intense. I'm just saying. <laughs> no, please, it's, it's legal in most states now. But I'm talking about something a little more magical. Children, you're you're responsible for the whole school system in the city. Oh, well, I mean, look, I, I'm just saying it'd be nice to. Go on a little trip every now and again. Uh, expand the mind. Uh, maybe think about new ways of teaching the youth. You seem to be doing a good job of it. I'm completely straight edge aside from all of the five hour energies that I consume every day. And day and day. Ah, that explains it. Oh, you're so uptight. That's true, but sometimes I have to use it rectally. <laughs> Okay. 
Um, have you tried affirmations? <laughs> no? I thought you were going to give me drugs. Well, uh, self-love is kind of like a drug. And uh, affirmations are a gateway <laughs> to self-love. <laughs> yeah. And they're free. I have a job interview. I don't have time to rebuild my, my inner child. <laughs> that takes years and years to be qualified therapist. I need something I can snort. <laughs> have you tried fresh air? <laughs> oh, a deep belly breath will restore you and could potentially heal your childhood trauma. Have you ever taken a real deep breath? <laughs> I do not have time to take a deep breath. It involves like counting, probably to, I don't know, six or eight. And it's just, I mean, I have. I can see it. I can see it in your aura. Like it just sort of, it stops there. But it, 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 could, it could expand all these things. You can breathe down to your toenails. <laughs> <laughs> it's with a needle. That natural high. I'm telling you, Amanda, a natural high. I don't like you since you found spirituality. I like Party Victoria better. Oh, she was <laughs> such a bore. Oh, she was Party Victoria. Wow! <laughs> 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 I want to do a line of singer! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, 
this position's only for one. <laughs> but I think we can make an exception. <laughs> Kristen. Jason. JD. Tommy. Yeah!